Welcome to VOV 24/7's Food Delight with cooking tips and recipes. I'm Kim Chi. Authentic cuisine is one of the major attractions of Hanoi. If a foreign visitor asks me what dish she should try, I always suggest spring rolls, along with fur, bún chả, or grilled pork with rice, vermicelli noodles, and grilled fish. Spring rolls are a Vietnamese dish no tourist should miss. On today's show, we welcome once again Lê Thị Thu Hằng, who is in charge of cooking classes for foreigners at Koto, a non-profit enterprise that provides vocational training to disadvantaged youth. Today, Hằng will share a spring roll recipe. Two kinds of different spring roll. One is a fresh spring roll, and the other one is fried spring roll. Fresh spring roll. All the ingredients should cook before you roll the spring roll. Or you can eat things raw. But fried spring roll. All ingredients should raw. And when you finish to roll the spring roll, you should to deep fry, make all the filling is cooked. Today, Hang Wun tells us how to make fresh spring rolls with fish and herbs, a recipe she often teaches to foreigners at her koto cooking class. Please tell us what things you need for this dish. With the fish, you can eat the fish from the sea or uh, fish from the river. The second ingredient is a fresh turmeric. You can eat the turmeric powder or the fresh one rice paper, and then pineapple. With a fresh spring roll, uh, very popular and very important with a pineapple. Cucumber, cucumber, just cut about the, like the bacon or a chip, and rice vermicelli. Rice vermicelli, you can eat in the fresh one or the dry one. With a uh, seafood, like the squid or the fish, it's very good to go together with the deer or coriander. Coriander, we using for everything in here. And the carrot, carrot, we need to lean it because the carrot a bit hard. With fresh spring rolls, remember that all the ingredients inside the spring roll needs to be cooked beforehand. Hang, how should we cook the fish? Is the fish grilled or fried? Peel the, the skin from the turmeric and then you should mash the turmeric by the mosta or by the blender. You can use what uh, equipment you have. Add a little bit water inside until the turmeric is uh, smooth. You can take the, the juice from the turmeric. With the fish, we need to uh, trim it, take the bone off, cut about like the bacon. And after that, we need to mine it with the uh, turmeric, make the fish have the color from the turmeric. Then we need pan fry it. Just pan fry it one side, one minute, and turn this next side. It's one more minute, it's finished. Now all the ingredients are ready. The fish is ready, the herbs, pineapple, measly. Now it's time for us to roll the spring rolls. Put some herbs in the bottom first. Uh, you can put some uh, carrot, cucumber, and pineapple. After that, the noodle on top, and then the fish, the fish on, on top. But please remember, when you put the filling, put all the filling the same layer with the rice paper, and then roll it up. Spring rolls always go together with dipping sauce. The sauce contains fish sauce, sugar, vinegar, and some water. But we should use the right portions to create the perfect dipping sauce for fresh spring rolls. With the dipping sauce for the fresh spring roll, it's like the, the, the nem cuốn cá. We can use a half cup of the water, three tablespoons of the sugar, three tablespoons of the rice vinegar, two tablespoons of the fish sauce and a half teaspoon of the salt and mix it well until the sugar and the salt dissolve. Put some coloring inside like the garlic and the chili. With familiar ingredients like fish and herbs and some simple steps, why don't you diversify your menu with fresh spring rolls with fish and herbs? Thank you Hang for your time. Goodbye everybody.